I greet you in Jesus' precious name. It is Monday morning, the 27th of November, 2023. And this is your friend, Angus Buchan, with a thought for the day. We start off in the book of Isaiah, chapter 8, verse 10. For God is with us. I read that slowly on purpose, because we all need to remember that. God is with us. The proof of that is found in one page before. Isaiah chapter 7 and verse 14. Therefore the Lord himself will give you a sign. Behold, the virgin shall conceive and bear a son and shall call his name Emmanuel, which translated means God with us. If we go to Romans chapter 8 and verse 31, a scripture which I quote many, many times, basically it is confirming the scriptures which I have just read to you. If God is for us, who can be against us? (laughs) Yes, that's why you and I are entering into the Christmas season. That's why we celebrate Christmas. God came down from heaven in the form of a defenseless baby to be with you and me so that we will not be lonely anymore, so that we'll not be fearful anymore. Now that is worth celebrating, eh? isn't it? Because if Jesus is on our side, as the tennis players will tell you, it is game, set, and match. <laughs> What do we have to do from our side? Well, that's a good question. Simply believe. You see, sadly, Moses and Aaron did not believe. And that's why they could not take the children of Israel across the river Jordan and into the land of milk and honey. You'll find that in the book of Numbers chapter 20 and verse 12. How do we get that kind of faith? Well, that's a good question. Romans chapter 10 and verse 17 says, Now faith comes by hearing, and hearing by the word of God, by spending time with the Lord. Do you know that little picture of a little lion cub walking down a road, and the caption says, When you know who is behind you, the fear of what's in front disappears. As long as you know God is for you, Who is against you doesn't matter anymore. (laughs) Because behind that little lion cub walking down the main road is its huge doting mother. Now I want to tell you, God is right with you today. And you have nothing to fear. Jesus bless you and goodbye.